2,000 people and toppled thousands of buildings in Turkey and Syria. Dr. Mutua has called on Kenyans to donate food staff in aid of those affected by the earthquake. The cabinet secretary also said that the government is planning to send medics and volunteers to aid in the search and rescue efforts. Now, the Turkish ambassador to Kenya, Subute Yuxel, has appealed for help in mitigating the disaster that has caused untold destruction across 10 provinces. And as Mary Mwoki now reports, Turkey's president, Recep Tayyip Erdogan, has declared three month or declared a three month state of emergency in the affected regions. The aftermath of the 7.8 magnitude earthquake that tore across Syria and Turkey early Monday morning, leaving in its wake a trail of death and destruction. Authorities estimate the death toll to keep rising even as rescue operations are hampered by snow and poor weather. Turkey's ambassador to Kenya, Subute Yuxel, has appealed for aid from Kenyans of goodwill. Search and rescue efforts continue, but time is of essence. We requested, we requested focused international assistance from the international community. With the World Health Organization estimating that at least 23 million people could be affected, Foreign Affairs Cabinet Secretary Dr. Alfred Mutua has urged Kenyans to donate dry foodstuffs such as tea, coffee and nuts in aid of those affected by the earthquake. The CS has asked doctors and nurses who'd like to volunteer to travel to Turkey to treat those wounded to come forward, adding that the government is planning to send manpower to go and help in the search and rescue mission. I'm calling upon Kenyans to join hands in extending material support that will elevate human suffering, such as foodstuffs, clothing, financial, medical staff, among others. And so we'll be looking at how we can be able to send Kenyans to be able to help in the search and rescue. Uh, that is what is needed right now as, as a priority. Turkey's president Recep Tayyip Erdogan has declared three months state of emergency in the 10 provinces most hit by the Monday earthquake. Turkey and Syria are reeling from two consecutive earthquakes that have brought untold pain and suffering to the region. The earthquakes are the worst to hit the region in over a century. Over 8,000 people have been rescued from the rubbles and thousands others are still trapped in the collapsed buildings. Mary Mwoki, Citizen TV, Nairobi.